Good afternoon, I'm Mike Powers. For 19 years, he served Bernalillo County, helping to decrease DWI deaths, manage the Metro Detention Center, and started the county detox program, which eventually landed his family and the county in controversy. Today, John Dantas officially announced his retirement from his position as deputy county manager. News 13's Jeff Todd is here with the story. Jeff. For the last few months, John Dantas had been telling people at the county office that he was on the verge of retiring. Today, he said he would, but he insists recent nepotism claims against him are not why he's leaving. It was an emotional announcement this morning. Both county manager Thaddeus Lucero and John Dantas were pushed to tears. Lucero said Dantas served the county extremely well for nearly two decades. Juvenile Detention Center Director Tom Swistak was appointed interim county manager of public safety. Dantas' last day on the job is July 31st. He'll spend his remaining days in office mentoring Swistak. Dantas recently came under fire for allowing his son Jamie to work at the county detox center, which John oversees. Jamie faced multiple workplace violations but was never punished. He quit that job earlier this month. Today, John said his retirement had nothing to do with the nepotism allegations. The decision has absolutely nothing to do with, and I said that publicly already, with anything relating to my son. This is the time for me to focus on my family and on personal challenges that I have. It's been a great ride. It's been a wonderful time every single day to come to work. Following a county investigation into the detox center, two supervisors were put on probation and one manager will most likely get fired. I asked a county spokesperson if Dantas ever faced punishment for the hiring and special treatment his son received. She said since he's retiring, it's a moot point. Mike, back to you. Okay, Jeff, thank you very much. Now, we'll have more on what this Dantas retirement means this afternoon at 4 o'clock.